The Spider-Man that Jim Atchison created for this movie is very similar to the one he created in the first movie. At least it will seem that way to the audience. It's a privilege to come back and, and you know, have another go. We have made subtle changes. You need to be a real enthusiast to spot the Jim has gone in and made about 100 minor alterations to his original vision of that suit. One of the challenges that we faced this time around was how to change things without compromising the strength of the original design from the first movie. And the things that we focused on were the front and the back spiders, the color and patterning of the web, and the color of the printing of the suit. This time we're making 35 suits, because Spidey's gonna go through a lot of slashing and ripping and tearing. Over a six-month period, we came back to believing that we had to sort of respect the icon. In fact, the closer and more truthful we were to the image of Spidey, then that was the way to go.